The bill provides for the remuneration of the president, vice president, and their spouses. The parliamentarians raise concern over whether the bill supports polygamy as the country's laws allows for a man to have a civil and customary marriages. Hartap Regional Councillor Nico Mungenga called on the House to seek for legal advice to see whether it supports the remuneration of two first ladies in a case where a future president has a civil and a customary wife. We should seek for the clarity whether this thing is saying and or mm. that, the president, uh, that the president may have a wife under civil law as well as customary law, or whether it is the provision, and then we have got the concern of polygamy and what the legal implications of polygamy within Namibia is. It's a separate, complete concept on its own. But now, according to this, if it only means that if the president is not civilly married, he is permitted to have a wife customary, then I think if that, that is the interpretation of this law, then it is correct and we may, we may pass it as it is. Omaheke Regional Councillor Philippus Katamelo raised concern over the bill's definition of children born outside marriage and those born in marriage. Why should we have a distinction between a married biological child and an unmarried biological child if the child still remains the child of the president, of the vice president? Whether married or unmarried is no longer in question. I think there are court cases that have been out that have actually say there is not a legal justification that you can justify or distinguish between a married child and an unmarried child. Both of them remains your biological offsprings. Debate on the bill was postponed to Monday to give the House time to seek for clarity. Salmi Angula, NBC News, Parliament.